<laughs> Andrew, what was just kind of the difference in the fourth for you and stuff? Like, what was the mentality of just, I guess, the importance of an ending of this losing streak? Just find a way to win. You know, that that was it. You know, we locked in. Uh, most importantly, we got some stops. You know, and it led to, you know, executing on the other, on the other end. Um, yeah. This time, they, I mean, they really leaned on the starters, obviously, to, to win this game. Uh, it's been kind of a common theme. Do you feel like the second unit is, is developing into something? I mean, or can the starters carry this kind of load every single night? Um, you know, I feel like we're just, um, we're putting lineups out there and, you know, we're just trying to, we're trying to figure it out, you know, and I, I think we'll figure it out because um, there's a lot of talent on the floor, you know, on the team. Um, but as soon as the pieces, you know, go together, I think we're going to be a, a very special team. Um, so I got a lot of faith in my guys. Andrew, you guys had a really quick start, had a 12-point lead there, and then kind of lost it. And next thing you know, you guys were down double digits. What do you think went wrong there? Um, uh, fouling too much, you know, putting them on the lines, and they get back and they can set their defense up. Um, you know, and just executing plays, you know, as long as we get everyone involved, you know, keep swinging the ball, you know, everyone's in a good rhythm, I feel like we'll be all right. That's Steph going crazy, obviously, throughout the fourth quarter, but a couple big times it comes to you. Uh, is it, is it, do you feel a little different when it's that kind of moment and Steph's going crazy, but the ball ends up in your hands for a big shot? Oh, it feels good, you know, especially when my shot goes in. <laughs> um, but, you know, it was a, you know, compared to fourth quarter, um, like you said, Steph went crazy. You know, he's doing what he always does. You know, that's why, you know, he's one of the GOATs. Um, but I'm just happy to be out there, be a part of the team and be, you know, a part of, you know, winning, you know, helping these guys win. What's that like to be out there with Steph? He scored like 17 of his 47 points in the fourth quarter. I mean, lovely. <laughs> You know, you go out there and Steph is, you know, he's an incredible player. You know, all the attention he causes, you know, there can be two guys on him closing out. And he, if he gets a shot a shot up, more than likely it's going in, you know, and sometimes you can just find yourself just watching. Um, but he's that great. You know, he's a special player and, you know, very entertaining, even for us on the court, you know, just watching him like we're a fan. <laughs> but, you know, it's amazing. Do you say anything to Jordan Poole? Obviously, he hasn't had the greatest start to this season. Two points tonight. Um, just hasn't been able to seem to be able to get loose for some scoring. What are your thoughts on what his start of the season has been like? Um, I mean, he's a special kid. You know, he works really hard. Um, he's coachable. You know, wants to keep getting better. Um, so I, I got faith in him. You know, I feel like he's going to have a big year, you know. Slow starts to the season, it happens. Um, but I think he's going to pull through, you know, and, you know, have a special year.